Now, your 41 NBC AccuWeather forecast, presented by Volume Chevrolet. Welcome back. It's been a pretty nice day here in middle Georgia. Once again, saw a warmer than normal day with highs in the 60s and some mostly cloudy skies with a little peaks of sunshine. But overnight tonight, we're going to see the clouds really building into our area and we're going to see that continuing into tomorrow as well. Once the rain gets here, this is looking at right now on our 41 sky view overlooking downtown Dublin, a pretty quiet evening. And once again, a warm evening for a lot of us, 54 degrees out there right now. Dew points are in the low 50s, so we're not going to see a whole lot more cooling than that. Upper 40 is really going to be the extent of how cool it can get overnight tonight. But today we did see those temperatures make it up around 67 degrees. Normally we should be topping out around 61 for this time of year and 55 is where we started out the day. But there are some much cooler conditions on the way as we head into the end of the week. Right now sitting at 56 here in Macon, 58 in Sandersville and seeing 52 in Eastman with 59 over in Vienna. Much cooler though, just to our north and to our west. Right now, sitting at 33 degrees in Nashville, 41 in Birmingham, and 30 over in Memphis, where a lot of those places are dealing with all of this wintry weather. Right now, seeing kind of a changeover for parts of northern Mississippi into much of Tennessee. So they're going to be dealing with the freezing rain, sleet, ice, not much snow out there for a lot of those places that are seeing this wintry weather, but we are actually going to be staying mainly in those 60s and 50s through at least the next 24 hours or so. So that's going to be some good news for us. We're really not talking about any kind of wintry weather until we get to the weekend and then it's just going to be cold air. So as we're heading into tomorrow, that stationary boundary that's parked over us right now will continue to hang out. We'll see a chance for some isolated showers in the morning, but most of this is going to push in through late afternoon and evening. That's where we start to see a pretty continuous moderate to light rainfall overnight and into Friday morning. As we're heading into Friday afternoon, a secondary cold front is going to drop in, reinforcing this cold that we're going to start to see for Friday evening. So it is going to get cold overnight Friday into Saturday morning, dropping into those low 30s. We'll continue to see that cold into Saturday as well. The rest of this evening, really not a whole lot to worry about. Maybe a sprinkle or two. Otherwise, lows will be dropping into the 50s overnight. But through the day for tomorrow, you notice we're already back in the 60s for a lot of places. Our southern counties will be getting close to the 70s for tomorrow. But that rain really starts to move in pretty widespread anytime after around 6 p.m. We'll see some pockets of more moderate and heavy rainfall overnight. And through the day on Friday, this is going to push out. Most of this is going to be out of here by around 10 a.m. We are going to see some pretty gusty conditions behind that and our highs only warming up into the low and mid 50s. So it's definitely going to be a cooler day out there for Friday, but we finally get that clearing and we'll start to see more sunshine really throughout at least Saturday. So a nice break from the clouds that we've seen the past few days. That being said, we're still expecting to see anywhere between an inch and maybe even an inch and a half of rainfall across parts of middle Georgia. It all just depends on where that axis of rainfall kind of sets up. But in general, we are still expecting to see those clouds moving back in Saturday night into Sunday. Not much in the way of rainfall and we should be warming up as we head into the start of next week. In just 10 seconds, I'll have a look at our seven day forecast. At Volume Chevrolet, get oil changes for life, plus a 20 year, 200,000 mile warranty. Visit Volume Chevrolet, I 75 exit 187 in Forsyth. That's volumechevrolet.com. And here's your 41 NBC AccuWeather 7 day forecast sponsored by Volume Chevrolet. Temperatures will be hanging out in the low 60s tomorrow for a lot of us. Rain moves in for the afternoon and evening into Friday morning. But then you see that big cool down Friday into Saturday. Highs only getting into the 50s. Our lows drop back to around freezing Saturday morning, but a quick warm up back into the 60s and 70s for next week. For weather updates on the go, download the 41 NBC AccuWeather app and follow 41 NBC on Facebook and Twitter.